So our next video, we are coming to learn something called home and school. So by the end of this video, you should be able to I demonstrate understanding of how of work as a civic responsibility. Demonstrate understanding of work as a civic responsibility. Two, explain importance of education and work as a responsible citizen. Explain importance of work and education as a responsible citizen. Okay, so let's demonstrate understanding of work as a civic responsibility. So what work does your mother do? What about your father? It is good to it is good for everybody to work so that you can get money to support your family. So if you are not working, you will become what? Poor. When you grow up, make sure you work hard because it because it is your civic responsibility to work for the country. What work do you do in your house? Is it sweeping, washing, cooking, or scrabbling? Any of these is your responsibility. So in the same way, every responsible citizen has civic responsibility to perform so that the country can develop. So now the question is, what then is civic, civic responsibility? So civic responsibility is the duty that every citizen has to perform to avoid being blamed or punished by the authority. So it is compulsory for every responsible citizen to work in order to be to earn money to support his or her family or her life. Do you know that the constitution states the right to work? Yes, work is good but we need to educate ourselves so that we can get a good work to do in future. So let us do not forget that education and work move together. What do you want to become in future? The easiest way to achieve your aim is through education. Knowledge is power. So when you know what you can do, you can go a mile further. What is education and what is work? So, on the board, education is a process of acquiring knowledge and skills in order to live a meaningful life or to live a meaningful in society. So, work is the act of using physical and mental efforts to effort to do something for for purpose. I'm thinking again, work is the act of using physical and mental effort to do something for a purpose. Work is also known as occupation, career, trade, or profession. Every responsible citizen cares about education and work in his or her life. It is important, it is important to acquire knowledge and skills through education so that you can get a good job in so now let's discuss the importance of work as a responsible citizen at home the benefits of work as a responsible citizen at home are one work enables people to be healthy people become healthy when they work do you know that idleness can cause someone to fall sick yes it is true this is why everybody needs to work in other in order to keep the body active. So when you work, you are exercising your body and you are keeping the body to inactive. So number 2, work enables parents to pay for their children's fees and bills at home. Through work, parents are able to pay bills at home and fees of their children at school. Every responsible citizen must pay his bills. For the nation to develop so your your mom must pay her um, light bill and water bill and even the rent the, your mom must pay or your dad must pay okay number three work helps to provide basic needs so 
Work helps family members to earn money to provide basic needs for their family. It also helps to provide for other family members. So when your mom is cooking and other family members are there, you see that your mom will be able to give them some of the food. So this one helps to provide for other family what? members. And number four, work reduces Work reduces dependency on others. Work helps people to be independent. If everybody in the family is working, it reduces the dependency burden because people will not depend much on others for survival. Now that they are all working, they will be able to provide their own needs. So number five says, work reduces laziness. Work reduces laziness at home. When a child works consistently at home, it makes them grow to become a responsible and working, hard-working citizen. So let's discuss the importance of, of work as a responsible citizen at home. One, work enables a responsible student to prepare well for their future. Two, work projects in image of the work projects the image of the school three responsible students work hard to attract awards work helps students to do well in the examination work enables teachers to earn their living so these are the importance of work as a responsible citizen at school so if you work hard in the school it will prepare you well for the future and it also projects the image of the school and then it also helps the students to work hard to attract awards and then it also prepares the student to do well in it in his examination or her examination and then works also help enable teachers to earn their living let's discuss importance of work as a responsible citizen in the community. So as is there, work helps to keep the community clean. Engaging in communal work helps to keep the community clean and safe. Through communal work, people desilt choked gutters and clear all the bushes around to keep the place safe. And then number two, Work increases the worth of people in the community. People who work can save part of their income in the bank. In the bank, savings increase. Savings increase the worth of the people. Such since the banks add interest to the money they have saved, part of the money received by workers can be invested in different ventures to earn profit. Profit also increase the wealth of the people. Number three says work increases the wealth of the nation. Wealth is a large amount of money or possession one has acquired. When citizens work, they pay taxes to the government. The tax goes to the government in the form of revenue to develop the nation by providing basic infrastructure such as building of schools, hospitals, supplying of water and many others. Number four, work contributes to the development of the community. Through the taxes, the government will be able to develop all communities of the country. Government develops community by providing electricity, schools, railways, hospitals, bridges, roads, and water to the people. Now, how education is linked to work? Education has a close relationship with work because it trains the minds of people and prepares them for future. So each of us has a special talent that we need to develop in order to acquire good jobs. So we therefore need to study hard to acquire skills to, be, to improve upon our talents. The kind of work you find or do in future will depend on the kind of education you acquired. 
So now let us talk about how education is linked to work. So we say education opens minds to set up work. Education opens avenues to people to get um, opens minds of people. Education opens the minds of people to set up their own work or businesses. When a person is educated, he acquires knowledge and skills to us to start a business. Through education, many people have set up their own businesses and even employed other people. Number two, education gives opportunity for people to get work to do. So education opens avenues to people to get work to do in future. Education equips individuals with necessary skills to choose from different types of work available to them. People acquire basic skills in dressmaking, sculpture, graphic arts, and music from schools. The subject that helps people to acquire these skills is called creative art. Okay, number three, education provides skills to manage work. Education equips people with needed skills to manage their work. It is difficult to manage your businesses or a business or work without education. Many people go to school to study how to manage resources and time in business. A lot of people manage their own businesses because they identified their potentials and talents and started developing them in schools. Last one but not the least, education improves our positive attitude towards work. Education enables us to show positive attitude towards work. Examples are commitment, punctuality, teamwork and regularity. When workers show these positive work attitudes, there would be an increase in productivity. Education discourages Education discourages attitudes such as lateness and laziness in school. That's why when you go to school and you are late, your teacher will beat you. Okay, so that, this brings us to the close of the chapter home and school.